You can put worried, preocupada, worried. All right? And now we know that she's going to be moving where? Mexico. Mexicali, right? We're fortunate to have um, Mr. Alisaeus and his uh, skills here because we have many children who do not speak any English at all. So they're coming from a different country and coming in with no familiarity with our language and they're trying to learn the different subject areas that we have. I help them with um, their content areas, math, English, science, social studies, and as well as developing more vocabulary, social skills through different domains. So listening, reading, language, speaking, and writing. Have something like this. So we're gonna write how a math I felt at the beginning, middle, and end. Having someone there that can break down the material, having someone there that understands not only their language, but their culture, it is helpful because it gives them a sense of security and it gives our classroom teachers who do not speak a different language, it gives them a, a different resource so that they know how to better reach the kids and how to better help them in their learning. I'm a product of an ESL classroom because I spent um, some years of my life in Bridgeport, Connecticut. So my home language is Spanish as well. So, you know, I can relate to what these kids are feeling. I stay living in the USA, crossing the border in Tijuana. was crazy every young world. I've seen their grades progressing. I see more participation in the classes. They try to connect with other kids, especially um, English speakers. So that's, that's a major um, achievement.